how much does she owe? Well, about 11 years ago, Frank Williams reinvested all of the equity in his property when he bought some new equipment and made some improvements in the structures, the barn, the stable, fences. He also increased the livestock population. The costs were substantial. Well, times were good back then. He did what any man would do. He believed in himself. He built upon his parents' foundation. Yeah, I get it, but the numbers don't lie. Uh, the 30-year loan started off as interest only for the first 10 years, but then it recently uh, converted to a adjustable rate loan with interest and principal for the next 20 years. What's the number? Uh, $702,589.21. The 150 acres in its current condition appraised out at about 750000 The house? Around 50000 more. My advice is to get out now while you can walk away with a little money so that you can make a down payment on a nice house near the city before you lose everything. Do you mind? Huh? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> not at all. <laughs> I served with a guy named Dick Olson back in 67. What are the odds? Well, today must be your lucky day. Dick Olson was my father. If it wasn't for him, there's a good chance I wouldn't be sitting here. <laughs> Me neither. <laughs> How's he doing? Uh, well... Two 13-month tours in Vietnam was tough on him coming home. A trip back there seemed to gain some closure for a while, but it didn't last very long. He took his own life a couple of weeks after he got back. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Sarge is a true American hero. I'll, uh... I'll hold off on that second uh, letter. You let me know what you decide, huh? Semper Fi. Booyah!